गाइस दिस माफी 97 एंड टुडे आई हैव द एंटेक सी40 सीपीयू कूलर दिस सीपीयू कूलर हैज सपोर्ट फॉर ऑल द लेटेस्ट चिपसेट्स लाइक 1366 it's a quite old model it was released in 2013 14 and okay uh, this has a <coughs> <coughs> uh, uh, this has a cpu fan which can run about uh, to, uh, 2000 uh, rpm and produces 25 decibel of noise and the fan is obviously in blue color here you can see the uh, C, uh, CPU copper base to which the CPU would connect and the heat would transfer to this to the fins to dissipate the heat. Now let's open the box. So here are the connectors which you will require to attach the CPU cooler to your CPU. Here you can see the CPU cooler <coughs> is on the right side and the other stuff for the CPU cooler is on the left in a compact box. Then we have the manual and the brochure and then we have a 80 mm I think uh, CPU cooler with a blue LED light which runs at about 2000 rpm and produces 25 decibel of noise cool, uh, if, uh, this, uh, <coughs> if you don't want uh, uh, this uh, CPU fan on the uh, NTX C40 you can uh, utilize another company or third party fans uh, for better cooling uh, you can in even install bigger fans uh, uh, like of 120mm if you want but that would uh, create a load on the CPU cooler here the are the manuals all in Chinese and this is the CPU cooler so this is the uh, copper base which you and uh, this is the copper base which you have to remove and apply thermal paste before applying on the CPU cool uh, <coughs> CPU the heat from the CPU would uh, go to the copper base and then transmit into the fins and since the fins are uh, very fairly spaced out the heat will dissipate out of these fins and then uh, the CPU cooler <laughs> will transfer the uh, heat from the CPU, uh, the CPU cooler fan would transfer uh, transfer the heat from the CPU cooler out uh, towards uh, outside the cabinet. That's why we use a fan. <coughs> so pretty nice looking um, CPU cooler. This uh, uh, has a efficiency of uh, uh, this has a better cooling of around 10 to 20 percent over the stock cooler of a 1366 cooler I think I am overestimating it has a better cooling of 5 to 10 percent over the 1366 sto uh, stock cooler which comes uh, on a Core i7 920 uh, 920, 930, 950, 960X I think 960X has a different cooler I don't know but definitely on the 920 better cooling uh, than the stock cooler <laughs> on the 920 uh, CPU, Core i7 920 let's see what we have in the box of the CPU cooler thermal paste from Entech always apply uh, thermal paste whenever you remove the CPU cooler uh, from the CPU for cleaning etc or installing a new CPU cooler uh, uh, always uh, properly clean the base of the CPU and CPU cooler of the old thermal paste before applying a new thermal paste because that could cause problem and there would won't be a flat surface for connection between CPU cooler and the CPU. We always require a flat surface for better 
uh, heat dissipation uh, uh, for better heat transfer <coughs> sorry guys okay these are the transmission plate which you install behind your motherboard to hold the cpu cooler in the uh, in its place uh, different one for intel and amd of course these are the clips the screws to install the <coughs> install the cpu cooler on the cpu and of course you saw the fan 80mm 2000 rpm fan quite cool <coughs> so guys this was the Antec c40 cpu cooler stay tuned for more detailed review on edge unified have a nice day if you like the video please like subscribe and share uh, thank you guys. Ciao.